you can't you can't tell somebody not to love the corals first of all let me put it out there to you guys be the shipper be the liquor lion be the rose army be the shy nation you can't tell somebody who to love just so i can tell you that oh you have to love this person no you can't tell a shipper not to ship the same way you can't tell a lion not to be about who she wants to who he or she wants to be about but as for me and me alone if you know this person has love for the corals and you're hating on that person, man, shame on you. If you see this person is genuinely supporting the corals and you feel like you're trying to bash the person because you feel like you want to just bash the person, shame on you. You can tell people can tell me what to do. But uh, I don't care if you've blocked. I, did, I, I don't care if you've blocked the Maro sheepers or you've blocked Lyles or Rose Ami or Shayo. Please unblock them. Ah, Uluwa Mew, my people. <laughs> sorry, sorry, we had to start Monday like this, but man, I have to keep my other lovely videos to drop this one first. I see the what? Like, I'm going to drop the love, love videos after this particular video, this one and the next one I'll be posting. Yes, I'll drop the love, love the videos. <laughs> Hopefully, children of anger don't come up with more drama. I just hope they don't come up with more drama guys to start with compliment of the season compliment of the season merry christmas merry christmas i hope you had a lovely celebration also and i wish you a prosperous new year even i mean even as we await year 2022 please as you celebrate please be careful take time to rest and enjoy good time with your loved ones so let's go straight to business my people on boxing day so boxing happened true true hmm. even though the actual boxing day wasn't literally i mean it doesn't literally mean i'm fighting and boxing and all that it actually makes boxing an unboxing gift as in um where you package your gift and uh, send to people but then for the purpose of this story eh, <laughs> is the bass boss boxing you know? <laughs> is the bass boss boxing for me because the drama no be here hmm so Likoro's Twitter space was fire, as in fire. It lasted for two hours. Pure fire, two hours of pure fire. Like everybody, no matter who they were or where you're from, they collected no be small. So not to bore you, I'll just give you the punchlines cause Omo the gist long, but trust me to do justice as usual. So, so to start with, should is guys, ah, I've always prayed silently for this day to finally come i mean where she will give it as they ought without mincing words this girl has always been begging them both fans and trolls all the time saying please we want peace i want peace and always begging them and i'll be like babe these people get coconut head ah if you don't use your hand fire them once hmm. and let all the asawa i mean the the tars among the wheat bounce and leave you alone. This madness will not end though. <laughs> so I'm glad when this finally happened today. She had definitely had enough. Two good hour space, guys. Two good hours. This is the longest uh, I've been on a space to start. Even my phone started misbehaving as usual. And empty I won't just let me shine too. But trust me, I have the food just. So it all started when she decided to do a space after cruising back to back with posts and replying fans on Twitter. On boxing day then she now decided to have a space however fortunately and unfortunately one of our co-hosts had issue with blocking some fans especially the legal lions simply because they always come for her and all of that the fight the back and forth of course for her peace of mind she had to block them only for lions to say that they have been blocked yes they came outside and also said they have been blocked that is that they use someone that has blocked 80 percent of lions as a co-host uh, uh, that's an exaggeration that is an exaggeration and besides if you didn't misbehave if you didn't trash her if you didn't do what you're supposed to i don't think she'll block you so some even went as far as hmm, now wow this fan base is a joke oh a supposed fave is hmm, a supposed fave is hosting a space and majority of her fans can't join cause some low life swines wow as speakers and co-hosts this is ridiculous wow 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 now wow guys funny enough the person they were talking about that they're saying the co-host that blocked them was ready to unblock immediately immediately the chorus made her a co-host in fact she already started just for the chorus's sake 
people were even advising her, ah, don't unblock them or remember what they did to you for your mental estate, for your peace of mind stake. Don't unblock them. And funny enough, guys, she actually deactivated her Twitter account, I guess, days ago just because of this constant dragging or because of the constant dragging. And I guess she was still ready to unblock them just for peace and liquorous sake. Funny enough guys, another thing, according to report, people blocking you does not stop you from joining a space except it's the hosts that block you. If the host does not block you, whoever the, this thing is, you should be able to join the space. According to many, they were like, so what was the issue about this thing that, uh, how should we should make someone that this thing, they can't even join the space. Now I think, so according to so many people, they were like, well, they just wanted to create unnecessary drama as usual. But I'm asking why now? Why drama every time? So she continued with her gist and how they traveled um, long distance in Bini and all that. Then someone now came again and said she should tell the lady to unblock that so many lions are still on the tier as we speak that they can't join or she should remove the co-host so they can join. Hey, Chineke God, this is what Allah, this is Allah, not so much like this. So she addressed it, Likoros addressed the case. Then the person now like, okay, you know what? Let me just go. So she willingly left as co host so that peace can reign. So that one died down. Then Rosna said, okay, so can I continue? Can I continue with my story now? One of the speakers out of the booth just said, no, don't continue with your story. Eh? Hey, wait, me around you, your good poopoo inside you, man, be bum bum. <laughs> See God. Mm. That is how Mama just sparkle and said, first of all, I can say what the F I want to say on my space. It is my space. God, you sweet me for Bele. Make her not lie. Like, it's not nice. She was telling you, I mean, she was telling them story about her journey to Bini and why on earth would someone say that? Then she now later said, who are you to tell me who to take, who to make a co-host on my space when they were saying who to hide and who not to hide, who to remove and not to remove. Hmm. No be small thing, guys. Let's go to more punchline. So another punchline was when she said, if you're not okay with someone liking or hyping me, you can bounce. Hey, well, like she now said, ask yourself, am I so in love with Likoros that I can't share? So I'm explaining now. So I think what she means here is that if you love me, you should be able to share me with people who also love me in their own way, sheep or not. And men, I think that is the question. All of them need to be asked. And then she now went on and said, I am a 26 year old lady. You can't control me or my life. If you can't respect me, please bounce. Don't come with me to 2022. If you feel you can control me or can't respect me. If you know the person has love for me, you're hating on them. Shame on you. If you come after people who love me just for coming after them, shame on you. And I'm like, wow. Like she was just spitting fire back to back, back to back. Then after that, she now asked them to unblock the people they blocked. That every single time they do this back and forth, back and forth, that it affects her, that they are dragging her name and all that because she's involved. She now dropped one banger, guys. She said, you can't tell a shipper to stop shipping. So also, Liko Lions to stop supporting. Like Everyone have the right to love who and how they want to love them. You can't tell them not to, to run their life. The people can decide to love and support who they want to support and how they want to. Like, you cannot stop shippers from... Ha <laughs> ha! From... To stop shipping. Wow. Those one enter. She now said... Um, like, she was just telling people that, how can you say you don't have, any, don't have anything to do with marriage? She says, excuse me. Like... You have rules in it. Like, I am involved. My name is there. She now gave one analogy that I really, really like so much. She said, said, I can like Tiwa Savage. You can like Tiwa and not like the Savage. It's all cool. No one is forcing you, but that doesn't mean you shouldn't respect God. Oh, my well, guys. When I heard this, I was like, come on, girl. Come on, girl. You are smart, man. So smart. So, at the end of the day, she values every single person that support her. No matter who, so Ima Rose, Liko Lion, Shayu Nation, Ami, you guys are valued. No lies, just stop the unnecessary fights. Like the space, no be smart in a fire. Even Tacha, simply Tacha was on the space, and I'm sure she probably saying, "Go, girl, that is out to run shit." <laughs> It wasn't funny. And I also like that she created a balance. Like, she addressed everyone. She passed so I'm you. Lion, whomever you are. Like, everybody chop. Everybody chop. Like, and at the end of the day, I just hope this space gives the result it's supposed to give. And 
she or even Emmanuel won't have to address all this fight again. Like it's extremely draining. Like put yourselves in their shoe. How would you feel if your so-called supporters are the one giving you all this while like every AK market day? It's all good anyway. It all ended well, and even the person they were all complaining about and was removed for them to join the space came back and apologized. And I'm like, wow, <laughs> what a personality! She even sang Liko Rose. We are sorry. We are sorry. Liko Rose also sang for them, and uh, like she just won peace at the end of the day. And on the lighter note, guys, I'm a shippa. Shippas are something else. They are crazy, man. It's how they always find. Oh, whole moment in everything for me. She reminds me of a particular ship. <laughs> nice one, Jerry. Like, life is very peaceful. Like, this one of them said, This one that they are both using bounce. I mean, this one that put Emmanuel and the crews are using bounce, bounce. Hey, are they about to give us a bouncing baby boy? Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. That's this one they are saying bounce. That means we should be expecting a bouncing baby boy first. Ah, oh, God. You people are something here. Like, we're like, ah, this is a double bounce celebration. Ah, <laughs> she passed. You people, eh? Like, today's bass boots and both on the crews and Manuel's side was pinned. I was like, Emmanuel was also pushed to pin his own bounce respectfully post in mid days ago you all remember right when they started their wala again today like they started fresh wala on Emmanuel's head today i will share that gist in my next video is about to go down stay tuned guys like it was not funny even bounce started trending that was how serious it was <laughs> just stay tuned so my people i just hope the 